season for giving. Yes. We certainly don't want to forget about adorable little four-legged <laughs> friends, right? So here with some sweet ways to give back to the animal shelters and rescues during the holidays is Larissa. Yes, it is the time to give back. Tis the time to receive and give back at the That's same right. time. And, you know, we have holiday parties this time of year. We send our ho Hallmark Christmas cards this time of year. Why not make it a twofer and give back at the same time of doing all the things you're going to be doing anyway? Exactly. That's what I, I say. agree with you, Larissa. <laughs> so this first idea is a really great way to educate all the people across our country yes. about the wonderful animals that are in our shelters yes. and our rescues. Yeah, so this was actually an idea I got from a shelter in North Carolina, so I can't take full credit. But over Halloween, they put up some flyers on their website and said, when you're giving out candy to all the little kids that come around, print out these flyers of adoptable dogs to hand out as well. Yeah, so I, I thought, I let's that. turn that into the holiday time and create these inserts that can go in your Hallmark Christmas cards. I so that is what we've done. And I put a little <laughs> video together showing you how easy it is. All you have to do is go online, go to the shelter that you're interested in, whether it's where you live or where the, 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 the receiver who's getting the card lives. So here's Pasadena Humane. You can find their adoptable animals mm. online and then find an animal that speaks to you or might be the favorite breed of whoever you're sending it to. You can click on that photo and then all you do is copy paste the photo in the little bio and put it in a regular Word document. Super easy. You don't have to like huh. reformat, resize. Oh, Just play around with it, see what you like, oh. and then print it out. And once you print it out, you'll oh. get what is right here and you oh can fold goodness. it up and put it in your card or the envelope and then send it off. It's genius. And it's just a reminder. It's and Go if ahead. I may say, if you're not technical or you know savvy with the computers, on our website, we've made our own that has a photo of Happy the dog. So it's super easy. You have no excuses. Oh my you goodness. can print that just as is, as you're seeing it. And it's just a reminder of so many animals in shelters and that adoption ever okay. after is Okay, that's a great go. start. Just so we're clear, Happy is not up for adoption. He's no. not available. No. He is just the poster. <laughs> yes. He's got a forever home. He's got a forever <laughs> yes. home. Okay, let's talk about this next one. Something that we can all do at our holiday parties. Tell us. Yeah, so easy. How many of us throw holiday parties, whether it's for our families or yeah. our friends or their kids or whatever? And you know, whenever you're going to a holiday party, you want to bring a hostess mm -hmm. gift. It's a nice thing to That's do. Right. But how many times do you receive hostess gifts and you're like, okay, it's really sweet, but I feel bad. You know, I have 10 candles. I have the <laughs> wine I need. So instead of asking for hostess gifts, in lieu, have people bring an item that you can donate to a shelter. So I did this at That's a holiday a party this idea. weekend. I asked my mama number two if I could set up a little bin and have all the guests bring something. And she said, sure, why not? Oh, and so we Rissa. did it and it was such a hit. People brought used items that, you know, like towels and sheets that they had washed. We got toys, we got pee pee pads, we got Aww. everything that you could need. And it's so easy to either have people run to a Petco or maybe something their animal doesn't use anymore right. and bring it. And everybody kind of liked the idea of not necessarily bringing a gift for someone, but gifting to an animal. And let me tell you, we did still get a lot of hostess gifts, so you won't miss out. <laughs> she still has tons of candles. Yeah, <laughs> yes, right, right, right. and bottles of wine and everything. Everyone who brought those, we're very thankful for those as well. No, but that is, that's wonderful. That's it's a so great easy. idea. And at the end of the night, well, I should say I've got all the stuff in the back of my car. I'll be bringing it to the shelter yeah. and donating it, and the animals will love it. So easy is right. Easy. That is key. Now, you even have something that we can all do for our Secret Santa exchange. Yes, okay, so this is a really fun little game that I came up with, and especially really wonderful if you have kids or a lot of family kids that are coming over and it's super easy and it also helps them realize the importance of giving back to shelters and animals in need so all you have to do I have a little video to show you is take a piece of paper and you're gonna write down the names of shelters and then you're gonna write down on the other little scraps of paper number amounts so like five dollars ten dollars you put them in two different cups or bins or hats you have each kid pick a shelter name and a dollar amount, okay? So maybe you get West Valley Animal Shelter, $5. You go on the shelter's website and you can find the wish list items that they need. Some of them link you right to Amazon so you can easily see how many they need, how many they may have received, the prices of everything, and yeah. the kids each get to pick what they think is most important to send. With the number that With they With the pulled. number, so if they have $5 yes. to use, if they have $10, if they have $8. Isn't that a great idea? Oh my and gosh. it's so funny, the one little girl that was playing Said, I want to do it again. I want to do it again. Yes. I thought I don't have more money to <laughs> yeah, yeah, spend right, right now. That's so right. that's the Let warning. Let me go to the ATM and then we'll play <laughs> yeah. it again. But right. you thought of that? Yeah. 
Yeah. My gosh, you should start And they had so much fun. Before we go, uh, you've got <laughs> one more reminder, one more, more way that yes. we can all give back. Of course, if you know, if none of those ideas sound like something you want to do, that's okay too. You can always do something really, really easy. Log online to hallmarkchannel.com forward slash donate and go to our Adoption Ever After Fund. We are teaming up with North Shore Animal League America right now, so anything that you can contribute can contribute will go to their wonderful organization so wonderful and they help stuff. animals across the country you know medical needs rehabilitation uh, all of it food everything that you can think of or maybe don't think of that goes into rescue it takes a lot of money I say it so. all the time but you are an angel sent straight from heaven Larissa <laughs> come over it's here I'm hugging it's over Christmas here. every day with Larissa in our lives for more information you all go to hallmarkchannel.com okay,